In this example, we're asked to use similar triangles to determine the length of the missing side. The missing side is x. Set up the proportions in as many ways as possible and show the results are all the same. So when we're looking at similar triangles, we want to set up a ratio of side lengths of one triangle to side lengths of the other triangle. So here's one way we could set this up. We could set this up as x over 12 equals 5 over 4. We could also go this way. That would be x over 9 equals 5 over 3. Now, I could also go backwards. 12 over x, then that would equal 4 over 5. We could go backwards the other way. 9 over x equals 3 over 5 doesn't really matter as long as you're consistent. And there are actually four other ways to set up these similar triangles that are correct. And we'll go over those at the end of the example. So let's see if we can use the information in these proportions to solve for x. x here is going to be 5 times 12 divided by 4. That's 60 over 4, which is 15. Here, x equals 5 times 9 divided by 3. 45 over 3 is 15. All of these x's should be 15. Here we have 5 times 12, so 60 equals 4x, and we're using the cross product method here. Divide both sides by 4, so 15 equals x. Here, 9 times 5, 45, equals x times 3, 3x. Divide both sides by 3. Again, x equals 15. Let's see what the four other ways I could set this up. I could actually go across triangles. So if I said x over 5, then I would say equals 12 over 4. And then I could say 5 over x equals 4 over 12. I could also say that x over 5 equals 9 over 3. Or 5 over x equals 3 over 9. And you should work these out to verify for yourself that all the x's equal 15. So just in these two similar triangles, finding one unknown, there are eight different ways to set up the problem correctly. There's about a thousand different ways to set up the problem incorrectly. So when you're setting up your similar triangles, be sure that you're working with the same proportions as you're setting up your numerator and denominator of your fraction. So x is to 12 as 5 is to 4. And that gives you the correct proportion. Same for all of these. 